Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to talk about the Alchemist class in Skyforge. I'm going to go over the talents, the symbols, what items you need, what weapons, and also your order as well. So let's start with the abilities. This, uh, this current setup is for PvE, so if you want to watch the uh, PvP one, I'm going to make a separate video for that. Um, what you want first for your number one, depending on what your key setup, you want uh, Predatory. This is for PvE. But uh, we've been testing out Creeping Horror as well, even though it says for PvP damage. Depending on the situation, you could spam this less and get uh, maximum damage just because it's a, it has a higher end damage and it will crit more. And also, um, depending on the uh, uh, your current situation, you could spam less because it's obviously it costs twice as much. Whereas um, the damage doesn't do twice as much, but you know, you're spamming it out. Um, so it, uh, it really depends on the situation. Um, but we've test out head to head with our alchemists. Um, they seem to be doing the same. If not, this one is more damage. But for the purpose of this video, let's go with this one. Just looking at the raw damage, um, this is obviously better. If you double all the the damage on this, it's uh, if you double this, it's nine thousand to twelve thousand, and uh, versus seven, you know, eight thousand to eleven. So it's not that much difference, but um, obviously it's situational. Uh, second one, you want this toxic emission. This is uh, when you start AOEing um, the group packs. You definitely use this. Activates impulse charge. Uh, if you have kinetic symbol, it'll, you know you'll do more damage afterwards. And obviously, for this one, you don't want anything else but reflect. Reflect is probably going to be um, depending on what fight it is. It's probably going to be the best uh, damage dealer here. Um, with this, you want to stand and keep this on cooldown in fire. You want to stand in acid. You want to pretty much just reflect anything that's reflectable um, back to the boss. Um, they did nerf this, however. You can only do uh, you know 33% now, not the whole damage. This was nerfed a long time ago, but this is still a very good skill. For your number four, you need uh, bow trap. Uh, everything else is very, it's just ignorable. You know, um, bow trap to just too much damage to uh, you know the boss. Just increase everything for everyone else's damage to the boss. So you definitely want bow trap. That's pretty much all your abilities, um, and you're good to go. Um, you also have you know perfected shell, stims, and spray, and also your heal as well. So those are defaults. Um, yeah, so that's that's what you want for your abilities. For your talent, this is a pretty much default setup. Um, this is what you pretty much want for raiding. Um, the only thing that could be changed is if you want more DPS, change this out for the toxic slime, and you'll d do DPS. Um, this setup I actually use for A4, and defense uh, algorithm is definitely needed because of the uh, bubble phases where it can just one shot you, and this will. Pretty much just negate it, and then you get it back immediately. Pretty much, um, you need defense algorithm. The, you need these two for protect membrane, which is your reflect. Um, you need this. You're spamming your left click anyway, so you're gonna get more um, energy back and you know more catalyst back. Double dills. This is so you could double stim um, on people. Um, this is needed because your terminal is now 40 yards. Um, this is needed obviously for the regen and also more energy pool as well, more catalyst um, by default. Um, this is spray. This is for spray. When you spray, you run a lot faster. This is needed definitely in raids, um, not just PvP, but and also you could dash for free. I mean, this is really, really godly um, ability, um, talents to have, so definitely get this. Alright, so we're pretty much done with the, the talents and let's go on with the symbols. Symbols is uh, pretty much uh, for boss fights, distortions and all that. It's pretty straightforward as, soon, uh, as far as like um, DPS wise. Um, DPS wise, obviously you want maximum recoil, maximum strength right now. Um, keep in mind that this is going to change in the future because instead of going with strength and luck, you're going to go with uh, luck and spirit now for alchemists in the future but once that comes out I'll make another guide based on it but this guide is for strength and luck build uh, for alchemists um, this is because once you go luck strength and luck your aura and everything else that you boost your um, you know DPS with uh, your party members DPS with is based off of strength and luck and obviously they're going tr strength and luck as well so um, you are synergizing with your whole group as a whole um, as far as uh, DPS, you want Maximum Recoil, Ultimate Strength, Warrior's Creed, 
uh, for, and all these are for obvious reasons just straight DPS boosts uh, you want lucky shot so you could crit more elements of surprise uh, I might actually even probably swap this with this as well because for longer fights uh, rapid attack it's probably gonna win out um, in the end but we'll see once I get level 2 of rapid attack and uh, it should be good to go but this is a pretty standard DPS symbols um, for any DPS so you want all four dots on here um, again in long fights they deep dive session and um, painful spasms will do the same even though your spirit and uh, uh, valor is you know on the low end because obviously you don't roll it um, you don't have equipments for it so that's why uh, but everything else obviously market death um, just time it correctly when you do your burst if this is up do a ton of damage and you should get re good results with uh, market death obviously paladin symbols so you don't die alchemist symbols proc every time use that kinetic um, as well so impulse charges um, Zerker is usually um, actually I'm probably gonna change this out I probably will switch this I don't know why I have oh because I was playing a Zerker earlier um, so I just probably just swap it out you know so you need this, this, painful spasm, all four dots, lucky shot. Um, you could do double uh, discharge to this and this. So this is maximum DPS right here, um, and you need nothing else. I mean, if you have uh, um, you know more, I think next week I should have 17. So I'll pop in more symbols. But for now, this is good to go as far as like maximum DPS for your alchemist. Okay. And for equipment, as far as equipment, uh, if your guild is doing distortions, definitely get the uh, 12 seconds to cool down. This makes it so your stims is 35 seconds and you can pretty much um, line up with your kinetics uh, sledges. So you're, you'll be buffing your kinetics every 35 seconds and they're going to love you for that. Uh, offhand, you're going to use terminal every 40 seconds. Uh, and yeah, this is instead of 60. This is godly. You know, you're going to be in Vuln every... 40 seconds. As far as uh, amulets go, uh, I, I just go with uh, acidic solution, which is your left click, more damage, and also more damage on the explosion. This works really, really well for me as far as numbers, um, so it should work well for you as well. Uh, da, da, da. So yeah, acid as solution, and you're good to go on that. Um, yeah, they're pretty much all the same, but what you want is acid solution. As far as rings, you want strength, luck, accuracy, uh, wherever you can um, obviously I have I don't have the crit right here but accuracy you want to stack that uh, so as you can see my accuracy is at 64 percent pretty much uh, crit with lucky shot it caps out at 50 anyway so what you want to do is you want to take away your lucky shot and you'll see a real crit um, that's pretty much it for as far as um, items and then your rings obviously you want to level up your rings as much as you can um, yeah and then spend the credits for it, you know, give it up and stuff, stuff, stuff. And you're good to go. And then your orders, what you want to do is you want to have this layout right here. You want accuracy, accuracy, crushing blow, more accuracy, and crushing blow. And then for these, all you have is pretty much just uh, um, this charge. You can actually get range damage if you want, but um, I like this just to keep the 10% um, the more damage up a lot more. Uh, so as you can see the only thing I need or actually is nice in here is just range damage So you could get that and the only thing that's good in here is just crit chance, you know, it's not nothing else is really good um, But yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. That's um, And kinetics uh, as far as kinetics rotation goes It's just you're gonna left click until there's eight stacks and you're gonna right click until it explodes once you have full energy uh, basically spam one on single target or spam two on multiple um, you know groups of mobs and you're good to go on that shield your tank shield anyone who needs uh, shielding uh, for buffs uh, rotation it's gonna be bow trap spray and it stims your target and you're good to go on that um, yeah so make sure bow trap is always uh, on the boss uh, as fast as you can this is because look at this um, the cooldown I'm sorry the duration it's 10 seconds 9 seconds and then 8 seconds so you're gonna you're gonna be on par so once you cast this this and this it's gonna be synced up to about eight seven eight seconds so you get to go on that just remember that order and you're good to go uh, keep in mind that also you heal once you heal it puts a debuff on a pe uh, on the person 
and it's a five minute debuff so you you can't really um, you know heal more than that with uh, alchemist because you will get a debuff on it um, also keep in mind that stimulus injections you can only if you do X once you will put up only one buff uh, for stimulants but it's the cooldown is halved so but usually people just spam double X on a, on a target and they're good to go on that um, otherwise yeah um, but yeah that's, that's pretty much it for uh, alchemist um, thanks for, thank you for watching I hope this helped uh, alright thanks have a good day